بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس اور ٹوڈیز لیکچر از آف یونٹ نمبر فور ٹرننگ افیکٹ آف فورسز دا آبجیکٹیوز آف دس لیکچر آر ریجڈ باڈی ایکسز آف روٹیشن ٹارک اور مومنٹ آف اے فورس ان دس چیپٹر وی ویل انڈرسٹینڈ دیز ٹاپکس ان ڈیٹیل with different examples first of all we will define rigid body a rigid body is the body on which when force is exerted it does not compress and the non rigid body oppositely it compressed just like given in the examples below labeled with rigid body and non rigid body on rigid body force is applied but it is not compressed but on non rigid body force is applied it is compressed similarly this running man is also is an example of rigid body as he is not compressed also gears cams and mechanisms are the examples of rigid bodies now axis of rotation is the axis or line about which the body rotates just like in this example x of rotation is a vertical line in this example and the wheel is turning about this fixed axis which is called axis of rotation x of rotation with rigid body has different definition during rotation motion of rigid body all the particles of the rigid body moves along the circular path the line passing through the center of these circles is called axis of rotation so this is another definition of rigid body's axis of rotation in this case all the particles are moving along the circular paths about a fixed axis so this is a simplest example of rigid body rotating in circle now what is torque torque is basically the force multiplied by perpendicular distance torque is equal to f into l now if we apply point pivot at this point at which the door is fixed and we apply a force f at the other end of the door so now this force will produce torque only if there is a perpendicular distance from f to axis of rotation this perpendicular distance is r perpendicular just as r is equal to f into perpendicular r now this force is acting on the door and it is causing rotation now if we apply the force at this point then it will cause less torque because the distance caused by it is smaller as compared to this and if we apply force at this point the distance is zero so no torque will be produced at all as torque is equal to f into l similarly if we apply large magnitude of force at this point at the pivot point no torque will be produced and again if we apply the force parallel to moment arm no torque will be produced as the force will pass directly to the moment arm that will cause zero torque in this case we will also explain some practical examples of the torque just like f uh, is uh, suppose we have a value of 5 newton and r has uh, a value of 0.75 meter so torque is the product of force and r therefore uh, 5 multiply by 0.75 so total torque is equal to 3.75 newton meters so this is the net torque acting on this uh, door at 5 newton force now if we apply the same force of 5 newton at a distance of 0.25 meters from pivot point so the torque will be 5 times 0.25 so in this case the torque will be equal to 1.25 newton meter 
which is very least value as compared to 3.75 so this means that the torque produced by 5 newton force at the larger distance from the pivot point is larger than the same force at the nearest to the pivot point of 0.25 newtons